Hi, in this video we're going to show you a nice tool you could use to make comparisons between uh, things like directories, uh, files, and even websites. It's called WinMerge. So it's a free download. So you just need to download the uh, zip file and extract it and run the executable. They might even have an installable version. I'm not sure. You'll have to check the website. So we'll just run it like this. And so now we have it open here. So you could do manual comparisons if you want to like type in text or copy and paste in stuff. Or if you do an open, you could compare up to three different items. So I have this one before where I compared, let me get rid of this one here, some photos. So you can see it found the difference. This one has a red circle drawn around. This one doesn't, so it marked the difference. So if we go back and we add the third one here. So this one's not even related. So you'll see how uh, it just blocks it all out because there's nothing really to compare. So that's how the photo works. So let's try a new one here. Let's do directories. So we're going to do the documents folder on the C drive. Then I have another documents folder on the E drive here with similar items in it. I'm going to get rid of this here. So I'll compare. All right, so you can see, you know, some things are marked as identical. This one has only items on the left side. Let me see if I could shrink this up here so we could see everything. Identical, left only, folders are different. Tells you the dates. Left side only for this. Okay, so then we have this uh, text file here. For some files, you could actually compare the files. So if you right-click on it, compare, you can see the differences here. Well, other files, I think I have a Word file here that's different. Let's try this here. You can see it's just gibberish because I can't compare them. It'll just tell you that... Uh, they're different. So that's the uh, directory comparison. And like I said, you could do three directories if you want on this as well. Then, of course, you could open files directly. So let's say we do uh, on the desktop here, I have this file one. And I have file two on the desktop. And then you can see here the differences are marked. Like so. And you could also do uh, CSV files, or tables as they call it. So let's find some of these here. So you can see the differences are highlighted right there as well. So that's kind of cool. So you have the text, the table, binary, image. You can even do web pages. So let me go copy and paste some web pages in here. So I'll be right back with that. So as you can see, you could actually load them into the software and actually view the pages. And then you can come up here and compare uh, what you want to do here, text, resource tree, even HTML. So you can see some things are the same. Obviously, most of them is going to be different because it's a completely different websites here. OK, so you have some other options up here, too. You can see you know, next and previous difference one at a time here. First, current, last difference. Copy left to right, right to left. Some other items here, depending on how what you have selected. And you have all your options here, refresh, redo and undo, uh, history. And you have some options up here. You want to do new, new three panes, open the conflict file, open the clipboard, you get save your projects, all your view options, your merge options. If you want to merge your files, 
customize columns and filters. You could add some plugins and view windows. So that's just a basic overview. So obviously it does more than what I showed you. I just want to give you the quick overview of what this does so then you could actually try it out for yourself. So I'll put a link in the description and you could uh, download it and see how it works for you. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.